New CDC data shows birth rates are dropping in the U.S. Jackie Ibanez looks at the impact that could have on the economy. Sharp declines in birth rates could be birthing new problems for the future health of the economy. Between 2007 and 2022, the nationwide birth rate dropped by roughly 23%, according to data from the CDC. In the near future, we are going to have a change in the composition of the workforce. If this downward trend continues, Justine Hervé of the Stevens Institute of Technology believes it will initially create workplaces with a higher number of older employees and fewer younger people on staff. Jobs that were previously held by um, young people are not going to be vacant. And so the question that's important here is, are we going to be able to like retrain people so that these jobs get filled? An aging society with a shrinking birth rate can also reduce the number of eligible workers paying taxes that help cover older people's pensions and health care. Fewer active workers are going to have to support a bigger population of retirees. Um, and, you know, if you combine this with the fact that there's rising inflation, and more and more difficulty to access hormoning for the younger generation, that's probably going to imply like some hardships for the younger generations. Hervé says it could force governments to restructure tax systems to account for deficits in social programs. Perhaps diverge a little bit from income and sales tax to fund their social programs and instead uh, rely more on um, other types of taxation. You know, it could be like environmental taxes or uh, property taxes instead.